the logical projects. What are activity codes? Well, it is a way to label or tag and group in a specific code. This is especially handy for reporting or even quick filtering. How do we do this? Well, first we go to enterprise, activity codes and click modify. First, we need to make a new section. I'm going to call this section peers abutments. I click close and then look for it under the drop down. So peers abutments. Click add. And I want to add two specific codes abutment A and peer B. It is also possible to add more codes below, but for the sake of demonstration, I will only show you two. After you have set your codes up, click close and then go back to your data sheet. Right click and look for a new column called peers and abutment. Here, you can now add in your specific code to whichever activity has abutment A or peer B. Now, the quick way to do this is by setting up a filter. And I have some preset ones done already. So let's say abutment A. Set up a filter where the activity name contains abutment A. Click OK. Apply it. and you have only the activities in abutment A. So simply double click and set your code. And using the fill down, we can easily transfer this code to all sections, like so. We'll now do the same thing for peer B. And then finally remove your filter. So now in your program you'll notice that you have activity codes for A and B set up. You can also follow up by creating activity codes for C, D, E and F and abutment G. These codes will come in help handy when you want to report or even filter through data in the future. Thank you very much, and I hope this was informative.